best way to navigate shy ones with trust issues that don't reach out but always accept dates? Well, it kind of, like, kind of sounds like a shy and structured woman. I personally don't date shy and structured women. I like women who are outgoing and confident and say what they mean and mean what they say. I know some guys like like the quiet kind of girls, but somebody that's not going to reciprocate, not ever going to reach out to you because those are their rules, it's like she never acts natural. And you want somebody that kind of goes with the flow, who's easygoing, easy to get along with. And typically your structured girls have a ton of rules. Oh, no kissing till the fifth date. We don't sleep together until 3.5 months of dating. And just everything. Oh, you have to do this for me. You have to do that for me. And everything is rituals and routines and jumping through your butt. And you're, you just want to go out and have a good time with a girl and see if you connect. Not a girl that's like got a list of rules and jumping through your butt that she expects you to do in order for her to be compliant or to do the things that you want. And so, I mean, in, in that case, it's... Normal, healthy women, typically, once the guy starts the courtship off, about two, three weeks in, she'll start texting, hey, how are you? What are you up to? But it also could be that the girl that this guy is dating, he's projecting his high interest onto her, and he's ignoring the fact she's not really reciprocating. Because he he's super interested in her, and he just assumes, because she goes along with it, that she's feeling the same way. Yeah, he gets that, like, fantasy. Yeah. Of- and so guys, you know, talk themselves into, uh, you know, sh- women that show low interest and uh, making them believe that she's really super high interest. And so they keep pursuing, they keep chasing, and she's just not feeling it. Yeah, if she, if she never starts doing the pursuing, she was never really. Yeah, well, I mean, the quickest way to get somebody else's attention is to remove yours. And if you're, you've been dating a girl for three or four weeks or a month, but she never, ever reaches out. That tells me she's shy and structured. She might be following the book called The Rules because that's what it – it teaches women to do that. Make a date with a guy and then cancel at the last minute. Jerk him around on purpose because that will really get him hooked. That's and insane. then he'll do what you want. What book is that? It's called The Rules. Hmm. It's been around a long time. Hmm. But it's like that kind of stuff. And so that girl is not acting natural. She's come across some woman that wrote that book who's got some daddy issues of her own. And she's being manipulative and inauthentic. I mean, she's making zero effort because that's what it sounds like. This girl doesn't reach out at all. And she's either not interested or she's following a set of rules. And you want somebody who's easygoing, easy to get along with, easy to communicate with, not a boss girl pain in the ass who's always giving you a hard time and making you jump through your butt in order for things to happen that you want to happen with her. It'd be easier just to move on and find somebody else. But if you've been dating a couple of months and she's never once reached out to you, but she always goes out with you, don't text her for a few weeks. Just see what happens. If you don't hear from her for a few weeks after a couple of months of dating, it's like... You guys weren't really dating. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like, do you really want a girl who's like not going to give a shit if you disappear? Yeah. You go like missing. She's like, oh, okay. Yeah. You never hear from her. It's like, well, obviously she didn't care. So if you remove your attention and you don't hear from her, we're like, well, obviously you know where you stand then. But if it's a part of her culture that she's that way, like let's say she comes from like a Indian Muslim type family and they have rules, you know, or levels to prove that you're actually worthy to be like a boyfriend, husband kind of person. Yeah. Again, it's a structured woman. She's following a set of rules. It's it's obnoxious and it's it doesn't go with the flow. It interrupts just the natural evolution. And, and plus the guy's going to make all the effort. And she's going to do nothing. You want somebody that's going to reciprocate it. And normal, healthy women will start reciprocating typically around the second or third week, usually after you guys have had sex. That's when they start reaching out a day or two after your last date. Maybe they send you a meme or, hey, how are you? Hey, I was thinking about you. Or just, hey, you're all's favorite pickup line. Mm -hmm. And then you just use that as an opportunity to set the next date. But if she never, ever reaches out at all, like I, I wouldn't put up with that and so there's a good chance that, that girl's really not even into that guy she just goes along with it because it's better than staying at home looking at the four walls and hey there's a free meal and maybe she'll meet one of his friends or some other dude when she's out and then she can give her number to him yeah if the girl likes you she'll make the effort and if she doesn't again she's structured or she's not into you mm-hmm. you want somebody who has enthusiasm not somebody that's like eh enthusiasm eh 